Being the lead actress in a performance can be difficult. Fame, wealth, gifts, admirers. Are these the things you want? Be careful what you wish for. More often than not, it comes at a high price. Welcome back, everyone! Yara Gibbs is here, and we're back for another puppet show. This is the beta and the 13th game in the series. If you want to see 1, 2, all the way up to 12, I have recorded every single one of them. And if you go back to some of the earlier puppet shows, it might be a little cringy. But hey, you know what? If that's your thing, I welcome you to go back to the channel and look up some of my earlier puppet show series. Started my channel on Hopa's back in probably 2012-ish. Puppet Show was one of my absolute first Hopas I ever recorded. So here we are, number 13, and we're doing this live. You can see in the top left corner, we got a bunch of folks chatting there saying hello. Hi, YouTube. We're gonna go ahead and actually do a new profile because I wanna show you folks how they do this here. And I don't often get a chance to do that. So we're gonna go ahead, uh, sadly, your Gibbs is probably going to have to disappear. And uh, here we go, folks. So now we get to pick not only our... Well, we get to pick our face. Let's just call it like that and our haircut. So, Chad, go ahead and let me know. What do you think? One, two, three, four, five, or six. I'm going to go ahead and name our character. Actually, you know what? It's going to depend on the gender. How about that? Once we pick a gender, then we're going to give our character a name. Hi. One. Everyone, so Raven's like, I would like the blonde, please. Yes, we're doing character selection. Three. Short-haired lady. Blondie lady. I'm not sure. If we click on it, what does this do? Ah, it shows us the picture on the left. Okay. We've got a blonde. Ah. All of the cool colors here. Oh, look at all the numbers! Teresa wants six! Here, let's look at the handsome gentleman there with the facial hair. Uh, oh, that actually has descriptions! Let me read these. Number three in Veronica, okay. <laughs> a successful writer who wrote a famous detective series. An inspired painter who works as a detective's assistant. A young private detective who has also trained as a lawyer. A pro political journalist who consults with the police on investigations. The former policeman who co-founded Dupin and Company Detective Agency. An international interpreter who is also an aspiring gumshoe? No, no, no. Alright, so I think uh, I'm seeing a lot, a lot of twos, so we're going to go ahead and call her Veronica. Because that's how I roll, and we're going to be an inspired painter who works as detective's assistant. I like it. Let's go. All right, Veronica, let's dive in here. We're gonna go ahead and hit that play button right now. We have doll, puppet, puppeteer, and puppet master. Puppet master looks like it just allows us to customize. We're gonna go ahead and play on the dolly level. Yay! Let's go. Oh, hi. After your last case, it seemed like a good time to have a family reunion with your cousin Angela. But the moment you thought of taking a few days off, you received a distressing letter from Angela's husband. I don't think Angela has much time left. Please, come quickly. You must see this with your own eyes.
And we're here! Dearest friend, your cousin Angela was attacked a few days ago. Since then, she's blotch. I've never believed in dark magic, but strange things have been happening ever since Angela got cast as the lead in the theater's latest production. She's in a coma and just keeps a mumbling. She, she. I fear for her. No doctors have been able to help. I don't think Angela has much time left. Please, come quickly. You must see this with your own eyes. Leroy Jenkins. Alrighty then. Uh, would you like some interactive help? I would say special features only. Uh, by the way, uh, the crispness of this game looks fantastic. And there's our little imagery up there. Veronica. Hi, Veronica. I'm loving the winter -y theme here with the uh, red and white. And of course, you've got classic puppet show inventory here. Finally, this is Leroy's and Angela's house. So, uh, what do we got here? We've got, oh, we have a map. Let's take a peek at that. Puppet show map. Oh, look at the dolly, so sad. Why is the dolly so sad? I like how it's all undiscovered, that's cool. Like it, I like it a lot. And uh, we've got our task here. Oh no, that was our achievements. Huh, cool. Oh look, a nice hot cup of coffee. I actually have a cup of coffee with me right now. So, uh, oh, oh, hi there. Who's this guy? What does this do? Okay, oh, the kitty cat is purring. Find the flower, find the flower, find the flower. This must be our collectibles, folks. So let's go ahead and dive in here and uh, move forward. I'm gonna go ahead and take that blade. This mask half is screwed onto the dummy. I can't pull it off. Nobody trusts the rag doll. Ah. Don't be afraid, Angela. Fire will soon destroy the curse and take you along with it. Somebody definitely wants to hurt Angela. I've got to figure out why, why? Oh, look at the little rabbits carved into the bush here. This is nice. Veronica, I can't leave Angela's side. Please use the spare key I sent you and let yourself in. Leroy Jenkins. I, you thought I was purring? No, I was not purring. Although that would be a cool trick. Oh no, the house is burning down. Wow, look at this fancy knife. Wow. Mm-hmm. So, uh, let's go and look at their stuff here. Veronica! Looks like the luggage company tied up my suitcase to protect it. Well, we're gonna cut, cut, cut. Thank you, a luggage company. Dear passenger, thank you for choosing Katzenberg Railway Delivery Service. We hope you're satisfied with our service. Your luggage... Safety is our priority. Gatsburg Railway Delivery Officer. Okay, we're going to take that blank piece of paper. The weather in Canada right now, September, late September, is ridiculously hot. Like 30 Celsius with a bunch of humidity. Cl like nearly 40 degrees Celsius when you add in the humidity. It is just hot, hot, hot. We've had a hotter September than we had an August. That's how crazy hot it is. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and do the simple puzzle and get into our own suitcase. Booyah! We got a whole bunch of a glitter right out of the gate. <gasps> Look at the dolls! It's dolls for days! I'm gonna gather up some change here. Man, I really like the music in Puppet Show. Ooh, we get to go back into time here. Hello, ladies! I think I just took her dress off. Sorry! Such beautiful pup tree here. I know there's been some folks that are saying it's automatons nowadays, but eh, that's just a fancy way to say puppet. <laughs> oh my gosh, remember her? She's so good! Yes, all, there's definitely calling out to the different puppet show games. Love it. Aw, heart. My cousin Angela sent me this locket as a gift. 
seriously, this is how we pack for a mystery? Kind of thrown in here. I don't know how organized this is. We have pills and a bat. Voodoo doll. Angel. I do like how the lights are showing here. So we need one more coin. You've repaired the doll? Okay. This is one of the towns I visited as a detective. That is a call out to a previous game. Yay! Hello, hello! Yes, you, the Caribbean is always super hot, isn't it? Uh-huh. I think I've been to the Caribbean maybe six times, and it's always been hot stuff for sure. Okay, what am I looking for here? I'm looking for a bat. Now that could be bat creature. Oh, that was another postcard. Hi, 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 hi. We need a bat. That is what's left. Anyone see the bat? The heat's messing up your laptop. Oh boy. Bats on the handle! Ah, thank you so much for shouting that out. Thank you, Anita. Leroy's key. Shoot, I looked away. Uh... <laughs> oh! Where's the key? I... Oh, there it is. Got it. Leroy's spare key. So we now have the key, we can unlock Leroy's front door. And let's go inside. Oh my gosh, there's smoke. Gotta open up the window. Finally you're here. Did you see them? Um see whom? Who? Oh, yes, we saw a strange masked man. He wanted to kill Angela. I ran after him, but he escaped. Right now, we need to focus on Angela. You know from my letter that... Well, it's better for you to see it yourself. It's starting again, look! Oh my gosh! Angela! What is going on with you? You know, this is weird because I have a cousin, Angela, who's very close to my age. And, um... I kind of keep thinking I'm talking about her. It's kind of weird. Alright, Angela. We're gonna fix you up. Let's see here. Uh oh. Oh wow. That's kinda crazy. Okay, hang on a second. I wanna screenshot that. That looks pretty good. There we go. So, Angela. Uh hi. What's new and exciting in your uh life? She's been like this since I found her unconscious. I came to pick her up after work. She was changing, but didn't finish. Her jewelry's still on. Oh, wow. She looks unharmed, but... She looks... Look at the hair! Um... How long would it take to wash and dry hair like that? Wow! Okay, focus, Gibbs, focus. Gotta gather up the bits here. But what? When I brought her home, I saw these symbols on her. No one knows what they mean. At first, there were just a few of them. But the next day, there were more. They keep appearing. We have symbols all over her body. Not the nice symbols. Where's X? Very, very long hair. She is related to Rapunzel, perhaps. Perhaps she is Rapunzel. She's just wearing extensions. All right, all right. Today, I saw some on her neck. She becomes weaker every day. I'm afraid of what may happen if the symbols cover her entire body. Wait a minute, you're saying the hair is like Ophelia painting? Well, guess what? That's what this game is called. It's got Ophelia in the name of the game. We have other assembly things here we need to touch. Loving the music here. 
Yeah, birthmarks all over her arm and her neck. Could be. Oh, Beatrice, the day has come. The curse won't quit until it's done. Soon, Beatrice. Okay, congratulations, we achieved our first achievement. Alrighty then, I'm not too interested in that. Look at how her hair crawls up the wall here. Wow. 